Hey guys, it's Category 101, and sorry about my voice, but I'm talking very bad right now because I just got in Palette Expander. If you want to check that out, go to my beauty channel and check that out. And I'm just complaining about how I can talk, how I can smile, how can I eat, and I'm a crybaby. Okay, so you probably wonder what you look at. Look at that. So you probably know. This is the setup we have for vaccinations. And we win next week. It is currently October 26th. We're reading them a little late, but I think we'll be okay. It really helps if you have a donkey or a meal. We have a donkey. Okay, so this is where they enter. So let's say I'm a cow or a heifer or a steer or whatever. And I come in. We have buckets of grain that they love and they'll eat. We have hay in here all over the place. They get, they, we get the nice kind of hay that we put in here. We save it for vaccination day. And things that are important so we can lure them in. Real nice and easy. And then we open that gate. They walk through. And they go down this narrow chute. But see that plank over there? And someone walks behind them with a plank. So all they can do is move forward. And from there, we have more planks. And we put it there until we can get that door shut. And then here, up here. Um, and what we do is, after that door shut, they're in this tiny little head gate chute. Your head, this is the rope that we use to shut the door. See, okay? Yeah. This chute, their head goes in here. And you can narrow it or make it bigger. It doesn't hurt them. They're not going to die. <sighs> I remember when we first started for H, um, I was younger, I was young, and I was so scared, I'm like, oh my god, you're choking them, um, when we first got a head gate, because we've always had animals, but we've not always had, uh, I mean, not always had head gates and 4-H projects, and, um, I've been, we've had cattle for four years now. Um, so they're sitting there, you reach in, you vaccinate them, and then you open this up, really, uh, I can't do it right now, I can't do it with one hand, but nice and wide, um, ah, no, I'm not as strong as my dad, but I can do it with two hands, like, I put two hands on it and pull, but there's the inside look of it. There's a lot of poop and gross stuff in there because they've been in there. We've already vaccinated. I'm sorry. I thought I'd do a video when I vaccinated them, but I was gone. I had a band color guard competition. So there you have it. That's our setup. That's what most people do for their setup. Some of them already have like something. They have the electronic things with an electronic giant drawer that pushes them. Instead of you said you behind them, but we, that's expensive and we don't have that. And we'll break it. That That's the main reason that we don't have nice things. Because we break things. <laughs> See, this is why you can't have nice things. So, yeah. Um, please subscribe. Hope you guys like the video. Um, comment on what kind of videos you would like me to create. Um, I... Will, I promise, this weekend we're doing it. I promise, I promise, I promise. I'll do the winning video. Um, what I suggest for winning is fence line winning, but we can't always do that. Because of the way our farm is set up, but fence line winning. It takes more time to do that, though. It takes, it takes longer to break them. Um, but it makes them a lot less stressed, especially if a lot of neighbors like us. Like, we have people right there, see that barn? That's our neighbors, and they get noisy, and um, if you have neighbors, warn them before you do it. You can hear them. You can hear them right now. They want food. Guys, you already had food. <laughs> um, They already had food. So, yeah, that's our setup, and the dogs are barking, too. The hounds are... Hey, quiet. You probably see a squirrel or something. Um, yeah. That's a setup. Um, I'll do the winning, but yeah, we probably won't be doing fence line winning. We break them. Winning. Oh my gosh. 
We need, uh, and then we break them with our donkey. Um, I'll do a tutorial on that one. We have one hooked up. The first one to be hooked up will be mine because he's bigger. The sooner better. The smaller they are, the easier. We don't want to.